Palmetto Outdoor Experience YouTube channel. Alright, I thought I'd make a quick video. So I went to uh, Home Depot a second ago, got me a new cover, but I had to make it a little bit higher. That's cool. I'm eventually going to make the dam on, on higher anyway, so we got the water. It'll just come through the spillway for now. But I wanted to uh, show you guys this. I got a couple of couplings and just put my old generators back in. Of course, the wires are broke on them, so they're not really going to do anything. But this is show how much pressure we have now that the pipe's cleaned out and the water height's a lot higher. So if you watch any of the older videos, the generators were way on down actually. And I brought them up about halfway from where they were. And we have a lot more pressure. So I'm thinking that we'll have a lot. We'll be able to make a lot more power. I'm thinking about trying right below the dam right quick. Just to see. But um Looking at you see how they how they're turning in there. Oh they are. They see the wires broke when we had this real big flood a little while back. So we can short it out right there. We'll you know put a load on it. Let's disconnect the pipe right here and just put it right below the dam. There's a lot of water flowing out. And right now we're really just testing. We'll light some LEDs up tomorrow when the new generators get here. I'll probably take these home and rebuild them, put longer wires on them, clean them really good, but to essentially be pretty messed up. They're working pretty good. So we'll bust this coupling loose right quick and slide this in and see what the pressure difference looks like. I still haven't got a gauge yet. I need to. not bad I don't think that there's that much of a difference from down there to up here really not that just a couple of feet on a dam if that that's a lot better than it ever was it's generating power And that's right below the dam. So the plan is I have a charge controller down there. I'm gonna feed this power into the charge controller, charge a battery, put the uh, lights on a photo cell. And that way our pond will be lit up at night. So thanks for watching. It's just a little short video. Make sure to like and subscribe. We'll have some more tomorrow. Thank you.